Evening guys and girls, um, it's Friday night, it's about 7, 7.15, something like that, and it's uh, pre-match party time, so it's pre-match drinks, Friday night, tomorrow, uh, the world famous Dundee United will take on Arbroath, the Red Witches, um, the home of the Smokies, uh, fresh from a, a cracking 2-1 victory down at Morton on Tuesday night, um, we're going for a straight 8th victory on the trot. Um, 10 points clear at the top of the table. Um, so far, I've heard that United have sold 3,000 tickets for tomorrow. So it should be a cracking, cracking, bouncing atmosphere. Um, so I'm going to try and catch a lot of that. Hopefully United win. Following Robbie Nielsen's Tangine Army. And we're following the title charge. 10 points clear. Top of the league. Win tomorrow. Hopefully Inverness lose. We could go 12, 13 points ahead. And it's one hand on the title. So it's following the world famous Dundee United with the Robbie Nielsen's Tangine Army down to Arbroath tomorrow, away from home. Going to be a real tricky game down there, real tricky. They've had a cracking start to the season. Drew with our fierce, bitter, scumdy rivals, scumdy, fundy, whatever you want to call them. Uh, last week won all. So it's time to go down there and show them Arbroath Smokies, Red Witches, who the real big boys are in Dundee. So pretty much drinks. Wake up tomorrow, probably got a hangover. Me, my mate Alan, my mate Barry's back from Australia for this game, so it'll be good to see him. Uh, three of us travelling down our road together, just the three of us tomorrow. Um, like I say, to see uh, part of the, to see the world famous and be part of Robbie Nielsen's Tangerine Army in the title charge. So, um, probably wake up with a hangover tomorrow. Who cares? Half twelve, so weekend. Long Alan's getting a lift through our road. Me, Alan, and Barry, right on it. And uh, down to Gayfield. So I'll try and catch as much of the action as I can, get as much of the atmosphere as I can. So come on, guys and girls, stay tuned. Follow me, Alan and Barry, and the Tangent Army down to Arbroath. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Cheers, happy Friday. FTD 83. Come on, United. So, guys, it's uh, Saturday afternoon, 12 o'clock. Um, just about to hit the road. Uh, leaving at 12.30 through Arbroath. Uh, to the Red Witches, Gayfield, their stadium is named. Now, I was at Gayfield a couple of years ago following United, and uh, that was when Ray McKinnon was the manager, and it was a bad result. Um, one all, I think we won on penalties in the League Cup, if my memory serves correct. Uh, credit to our growth today, that it's going to be a real tough game. They're sitting fourth in the league. Um, part time team, I think there's only two, maybe three part time teams in this league. Our growth is one of them, but they've had a stonking season so far. So it'll be a real tough game. Their ground's right on the North Sea. Um, so the wind will be howling in, um, so it's down to United to try and keep the ball in the deck, get playing, get an early goal, and make sure um, we get that lead. Uh, a real tough game down there. It's all it's all standing. I think the capacity is 6,000. There's 3,000 tickets sold for United. So we're taking a good travel and support of 3,000 down there. So it'll be packed. should be a cracking atmosphere. Um, I think they've got a small stand that holds about 600. Um I expect an attendance of about 4,000 today, um, probably about 1,000 locals are both supporters. Um, like I say, I think United sold round about 3,000 the last I heard. There was a couple of posts on social media saying it's just uh, pushing on the 3K mark. So uh, what a chance, what a chance United have got to get one hand, one hand on that trophy, one hand on that league title. Um, but one game at a time, big couple of games coming up, Dundee, next week here at Tanadice. And then the Dundee Derby, um, which I'll miss because I'm on holiday. I'll be in the Philippines, so I'll be doing a blog on an Arab in the Philippines. So um, don't forget, guys, like, subscribe and share the channel. And then um, let's go. Um, see you in Arbroath, guys. Come on, United. So, guys, that's us in Arbroath now. It's me, my mate Alan and mate Barry. Um, just arrived from the dish lens. Um, starting to fill up with a few United fans now. Um, so, a couple of beers, and then we'll get the score predictions from Barry and Alan. So, stay tuned, guys. Come on, United. Just so, guys, I think it's that time again. It's time for the score predictions. We'll go over to Barry Cunt first. Well, it's good to see you back, Barry, for this game. It'll be your first game in a while. Score prediction? 2-0 United, Clark and Shackman. Clark and Shackman, brilliant. Alan's sitting there comfortably. Alan, score prediction? 2-1 United. And the scorers will be Clark and Perry. Oh, not yet. I'll be uh, I'll be a bit more optimistic with the score prediction. I'm going to go three one United. United to go one nothing. 
Nicky Clark, Arbroath to equalise, Stanton and Shankland to win it. Come on, you idiot. So guys, we're still in uh, the dish runs in uh, our growth here. It's about 1.40 p.m. Uh, Alan's at the bar. I should really take a picture because you don't often see that. Um, so we're getting a few drinks in. Barry's just up there. I'm going to chuckle there. Yeah. Um, so hard cheers, neck. Alan. And uh, we'll leave to go down to Gayfield at about half past two. Come on, you again. So guys, we're about 30 minutes away from... Um, we're leaving to go to the, the game. I'm just pointing my camera this way. I don't know if you can see very well, but Gayfield, where the lighthouse is, the big white building just down there. Um, Gayfield's just to the left hand side of that, so that's where we're going. It's about a 10 minute walk. Um, so the beers are flowing. There's just a busload of Dundee United fans turned up inside, so uh, let's get a few more beers and get to the game. So, guys, I don't know if you can hear me, but there's just a busload of Dundee United fans up here in the, in the club. The place is really, really busy now, um, so uh, really, really busy. Uh, all done United fans here, so uh, big, big, big crowd today. So come on, you yet? So guys, that's us just left the dish ones. Um, me, Alan, my mum, my dad, Barry. Um, we're on the way down to Gayfield, so uh, it's not too bad day, it's cold but it's alright actually, it might suit United, it's not too windy, not too blustery, um, busy, busy, busy pub today, loads of Arabs made the trip down, about 3,000 of us, so let's hope uh, for a good result, to reward the famous travelling army, Tangerine army, what a support United they've got, 3,000 people down here today. Men, women, kids, brilliant. Come on, you head. Let's do it. So, guys, that's it. We're walking down to Gayfield. We're on the, the hill here. We've got Alan on my right hand side. We've got my mum and dad to the left hand side. Yeah, it's uh, so I do a blog. I'm a YouTuber, mate. Um, grammar blogs. It's all about United. So, uh, I just some guy just started chatting to me there. So, we're on the way down. Uh, fellow Arab. Uh, you can see the North Sea straight ahead of us. It's all Dundee United fans walking down here. Like I say, I want the right hand side of my mum, dad, Barry, the look just behind us. Uh, a lot see walking down the Gayfield. I heard a couple of cheers already, so this looks like United bus down there. So um, I'll switch it off now, guys, and uh, see you at Gayfield. Gayfield straight ahead. You can see Dundee United fans in the background. Straight ahead. So we're approaching Gayfield guys, so stay tuned. Let's hope the world famous Dundee United do it. For three points, anyone will do. Don't care how it comes. Shark wind, think it's minute. That'll do, that'll do. Come on United. So guys, uh, there you go, there's Gayfield. The home of Arbroath, the Red Witches. Uh, Sold on the United fans you see there. Uh, that is Gayfield boys. Switch this off, um, Alan's given me a shout to hurry up, so we'll switch this off and let's try and find our gate to get in. So guys, we're in a... Sorry mate, just stood Barry's toes here, but we're in a... We're on the ground now. Take the kick off. Created! So all done United fans here. All done United fans, behind the goal, all Arabs. United! Guys, it's one that done United. Warren Shanklin, first goal. Stunning, even my mistake, sorry. Stunning. Come on, United! Well guys, it's uh, half time, Dundee rated 1, um, Arbroath 0, sorry, there was uh, no way I could take more of this game, um, it's absolutely bloody freezing, look at the clothes I'm wearing, um, you rated they're playing against the win first half, so doing well to get a 1-0 lead, um, second half we've got the win behind us, so hopefully it's shoot on target, shoot on sight, definitely the coldest ground in Scotland, without a shadow of a doubt, but we're winning 1-0, so let's see how the second half progresses, come on United. 
Guys, just to give you an indication of how cold this ground is, uh, there's the North Sea right next to the car park. So, uh, we've got the way off the North Sea, Howland, there's all the plants, so I will spin round. Some pictures for going to take back to Australia, and uh, there's a the beautiful ground. So, just gives you an indication of how cold this ground is, guys and girls. It's bloody absolutely amazing. So, it's half time, one nothing Monday United. Um, wind's with us in the second half, so hopefully, we'll get a wee, a wee couple of pops at goal. <laughs> um, hands on that cord, I'll try and, get, uh, try and get the camera out and catch a couple of goals. Hopefully, a bit more United scores a couple. So, this is Gayfield, our world for you. Guys, that's it. Uh, final whistle, one more Dundee United. Um, as you can see, it's quite busy getting out of this game here. Uh, just about to get picked up, head back to uh, the home for a couple of beers, uh, celebration drinks. Uh, good three points, results went our way. Come on, United. Yeah. Hey.